I christened May's photography theme as Maybe This Will Work. So I've been trying new things. And so have you all. I've enjoyed seeing the experiments in photography that you all have shared this month. So let's talk through a few of the things that I did this month and when you can expect to see next month's theme. Some of the videos I shared this month were things that aren't unusual for me to do, but are unusual for me to share with you and to film it and everything. For example, I went out on my mountain bike with Raymond and we tested out some gear, like my drone. It was a day of enjoying the sunlight and just playing around with stuff. Another one was when I tried wrong brand third-party flashes on my DSLRs. That's an experiment that I was definitely nervous about, but luckily no cameras or flashes were harmed. In May, I often used an old camera and lens as though they were new. I reacquainted myself with my Nikon D50 and brought it all kinds of places. I shared my low light photography from my local science center. I took some portraits with it, both in the studio with lighting and outdoors with natural light. I even did a retro review of the D50. I used my older Canon Rebel T4i too, and even purchased a 24 millimeter pancake lens for it. That was fun while I was hiking in the forest because it's such a compact setup. One really big experiment I did was allow my buddy, who had never flown a drone before, to try out my Mavic. Luckily, it was a success. And during these last few days of May, I played around with the features on my drone for aerial photography and for video. But I also used it to try to get closer up photos of me using a new camera hiking pack that I have. Which leads me to that backpack, the Low Pro Photosport 300 AW2. I've been working on my review for it by taking the pack everywhere and testing it out. You'll see that soon. And I tested out and reviewed another gadget that I had hoped would help me with my videography, and it did. The DJI Osmo Mobile. It's an electronic gimbal for my phone. May was fun, though I realized that it wasn't really any different from any other month for me. I'm always experimenting with something. I suppose it's part of my job as Snapchick, but I did enjoy sharing more of those experiments with you. And I'm really glad that you all shared some of your own maybe this will work experiments with me. Now I will be unveiling June's photography theme tomorrow, so make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel, like my Facebook page, or follow me on Twitter so that you don't miss it. Thanks for watching.